Want a beautiful new smile without wearing braces? At Wilson Orthodontics, we're the area's only premier preferred provider of Invisalign, the revolutionary clear way to get that awesome new smile. That means we're Invisalign experts. And we're the only provider north of Atlanta using the iTero Scanner, a digital scanner that eliminates the need for those gaggy, gooey impressions. Discover more at WilsonBraces.com or call us to schedule a free consultation. With this Access News Break, I'm Luke Story. An inmate being escorted from the Hall County Courthouse back to the jail escaped Tuesday afternoon during a transfer to a transport vehicle. Sheriff's officials say James Edward Cantrell managed to hide in an alcove on the outside of the courthouse. He then got inside a pickup truck that had the keys in the ignition and drove away, despite the fact he was handcuffed. Cantrell should be considered dangerous, according to authorities. Gainesville City Council Tuesday night annexed 115 so-called island properties and then voted to begin annexing 425 remaining county parcels surrounded by the city. Most of the remaining properties that the city wants to annex are residential properties. Mayor Pro Tem Bob Hamrick said he wants to see the additional properties become part of the city by this fall. Councilman George Wingaman is the only council member who voted against the annexation. Habersham County Manager Jane Ann Allison has submitted her resignation at the request of the Habersham County Board of Commissioners. Commission Chairman Chad Henderson did not say why Allison was asked to resign. He also did not give a timetable for filling the job. And the Helen City Commission found out at their meeting Tuesday that six businesses in the city have been cited for selling alcohol to underage patrons. The six were among ten targeted June 29th in a sting operation conducted by the Helen Police Department. And Tuesday was the first day without any rain in more than two weeks in some parts of North Georgia. That was true in Gainesville, where a, sting, where a string of 16 days of rain ended. According to figures from Lee Gilmer Airport, Gainesville recorded 6.7 inches during that time. With this Access News Break, I'm Luke Story.